When a narcissist meets a strong INFJ, here's how they'll react knowing that you're powerful. All of us can agree that narcissists are self-centered individuals who have no regard for anyone or anything other than themselves. They'll continue to value your presence in their lives as long as you provide a purpose and satisfy their desire for approval. It doesn't matter if you're easy or hard to get for a narcissist. They'll still strive to obtain what they want from you. Everything is about the narcissists taking over, not you, in the end. Narcissists are known to employ a variety of tactics to get rid of anyone they perceive as a danger. We'll take a look at a few of them in this video. I mean, when a narcissist perceives you as a strong opponent, they'll strive even more to either subdue you under them or break you completely. A Sigma INFJ is not easily influenced by the opinions of others. It's understandable since these people have reached a certain level of maturity by the way they think and act. Before we continue, I'd like to thank everyone who has taken the time to view this. Anyway, I want to invite you to help this channel grow by sharing this video with any of your friends, family, or loved ones. I encourage you to subscribe to our channel if this is your first time here so that you don't miss any future posts. Your assistance means a lot to us. Let's continue. Today's topic is how narcissists deal with strong individuals who aren't easily influenced or who have a clear idea of what they desire. Confident, self-assured, and grounded people are less susceptible to being persuaded by narcissists. Narcissists are threatened by these people. However, this doesn't deter them from pursuing what they want, even after knowing there's such a strong resistance like the Sigma INFJ when it comes to narcissists. They won't stop until they get what they want. To feel better, narcissists believe that they must make others feel horrible or inferior. The love bombs narcissists throw at us. Even if some of us are wise and strong in the face of their trickery, it's their goal to alter our life and they're patiently waiting for the moment when we let our guard down. Narcissists may use love bombing as their preferred method of enforcing their will on others, although this isn't always the case, because when love bombing isn't working, they'll pretend to be a victim and make you feel sorry for them to induce your sympathy. There's nothing we can do about the fact narcissists care nothing about what others think of them. All they require is a starting point. This means that they will take attention in whatever form, be it love, affection, or sympathy. As long as you're emotionally invested in them, they'll keep working with that angle and add a little flattery and charm to help seal the deal if they can make you feel sorry for them. This is a way for them to slowly exert their authority over us and eventually make us do what they want us to do. They would fabricate a medical excuse to avoid doing their tasks. In certain circumstances, they'll intentionally injure themselves to obtain your attention. Complaining and pleading for your help these people will claim they have nowhere else to go. The phrase will be repeated time and time again. When confronted with a powerful opponent, narcissists often play the victim. By appearing weak and vulnerable, they're able to acquire your trust, which allows them entry into your life. Make sure they get into every element of your life until your defenses are down before you succumb to their pressure. There is a good chance that after helping them out of a ditch, they may turn around and dump you back in without apologizing for what they've done to you. So, be on the lookout at all times. To trick you, narcissists may claim to love you or behave like they've been wronged in some way. Because you're an unusually strong person with compassion, your downfall boosts their self-esteem and makes them think they're stronger and better than you are. The moment you didn't give them whatever they wanted, they just toss you out. There's only one way they can bring you to your knees if they can't directly alter you. Everywhere you go, they'll treat you as though you're a role model and want to learn from you. Although, they may not get to know you well enough to identify any vulnerabilities or secrets you could have because your mind is so strong. In this case, your closest friends and family members are other options for them. In order to gain access to your life or learn more about you, the narcissist will utilize everyone who buys into their lies. Narcissists are masters of the art of deception. It is likely that they would choose a deep friendship or family relationship. 
They'll do whatever to make you feel guilty and alienate you from your loved ones. They're just interested in one thing, making others despise you. Narcissists require the attention of others because they regard you as a threat. Betraying or abandoning a narcissist is never going to make their day. As long as they can find a new way to injure you, they'll keep looking for new ways to do it. As a result, they take advantage of any opportunity to spread misinformation and make derogatory remarks about you. They do whatever is necessary to get rid of you from your current position. A decent job isn't enough for you to hold on to your position if everyone is against you. They're the kind of people who'll accuse you of doing something you didn't because you're more popular and respected than they are. The narcissist will obsess over finding ways to pull you down. Every day of their existence, narcissists strive to acquire new possessions and experiences. To them, the only thing that matters is dominance. Thus, they will do whatever it takes to gain access to your life. In their minds, it's just not fair that someone else is doing better than they are. Seeing through the personas they've created for themselves is something they despise. The more they fail to trick us, the more they hated it, and also the harder they'll try again. These folks are offended by our high moral standards and sense of self-reliance. As a result, they go to great lengths to take our possessions away from us, even if it means causing us harm. Regardless of how easy or difficult you are for the narcissist, they're always ready to take on the challenge of defeating you. In the event that they can't convince you to like them, through love bombing or playing the victim, they'll try to deceive you and ask someone you know and trust for help. This means that no matter how far you advance, you must always be aware of their strategies and tactics. Regardless of how far you climb the social ladder, you will always be the target of a narcissist's attack. Therefore, be careful and attentive. I hope this information was helpful to you. Let us know your thoughts and actions in the space provided. Subscribe to this channel and make sure the notification bell is on so that you are notified whenever we upload a new video. I'd like to express my gratitude for your care. Thank you so much.